Today I'm going to be showing you a quick and easy way to transition from black and white to color. Let's head over to Canva and I'll show you how. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to head over to Elements and I'm going to grab a video. I used this one because it was very colorful and I am going to just set it to the size of my design space. So I'm going to stretch it out so it fits. And then the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to duplicate that. I'm going to duplicate it and line it right back on top. Then I'm going to head over to position. I am going to grab the one that's in the back. So the one at the bottom. I'm going to go into edit. I'm going to go into my filters and see all. So I'm going to scroll down to the bottom and I'm going to pick one of these black and white ones. Now I'm done with that part. So what I want to do is go back into position and make sure my top one is highlighted. And now I'm going to go into animate. So what I want to do is scroll down and find the white feature. So if you have free, as you can see, while it's wiping, it's wiping pretty fast. But if you have pro, you can slow it down. So what we want to do with the wipe, I'm going to grab back on here. I want it on enter and I'm going to change the speed all the way down because I want it to slow wipe across like so. And then you can change the direction if you want to go from the bottom up the other side either any kind of way you want to if you have pro if you have free you're only limited to that quick wipe across and that's how you do that one and we'll do really quickly we will do a stagnant in image so i'm going to go into my uploads and i'm going to grab one of my little fussy girls that i made um and i'm going to remove the background on her and then uh, what i want to do see look at that foot <laughs> that one's funny. So I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to duplicate and then I'm going to throw, throw her duplicate right on top of her. I'm going to go into position. I'm going to grab that back one. I'm going to go into edit. For this, I'm going to go into duotone and I'm just going to hit custom, which will make that one black and white. So now I want to go back into position to make sure I grab the white one. I'm going to grab that top one right there. And then I'm going to go into animate. I'm going to look for white. And I want this one coming up from the bottom. And I want to slow it down. So I'm going to slow the speed down on that. And there you got that white coming up for that. Man, that foot, that foot right there is just tripping me out. It's funny. Um, yeah, AI has oddballs. And that's how you do that. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. And it's a cool little effect to, cool little transition to do. So I want to thank you guys for stopping by. You know I love you, and I hope to see you on the next one. Bye, y'all.